Hello. Hello. Can you hear hey. me? Hey. Hey. Yes. What's going on? Um. Well, I was trying to talk to you. Um. You know, a while back because um, just the, some things that were said on um a Chud Logic stream. You know, where I was getting dogpiled and lied about. <laughs> uh, okay. None of those ever retracted um by anybody and um i don't have anything to say about those other people involved but i was really hurt to hear you go in there and start dogpiling me with them with uh claims that i believe to be completely untrue and i would just really like to understand where that misunderstanding took place so that i can talk that out because again like i just i really think there's been a misunderstanding here. Sure. Um, you may have to refresh my memory because I don't know which um, Chud Logic stream it was and what exactly things were being said. Um, well, the so, one where you were talking about me. Yeah, I I don't. It was, it, that's from so long ago. I don't remember what. Maybe I could have. Maybe it was like regarding like uh, um, the school shooter people or something. Was it I don't that? know because I don't have any idea what you're talking about with i don't have any content about a school shooter oh but if know. that's what you think no no then then um... you've probably been misinformed but um you know i think that uh what was said was but was you okay, know i was so, getting yeah. dogpiled by uh you know the commentary guys the commentary bros you know the ones that uh have been tormenting me for over a year ever since i defended you from those racists online and they uh, basically use the opportunity to piggyback the hate and spread that video around. Do you remember that? Yeah, I remember that. That was super shit. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. you know, those same guys that you're buddy buddies with right now, I guess, are shitting all over me. And so... Um, Which ones? Well, I, I, I'm not going to get it. I'm not going to, like, bring them, even bring them up, okay? I'm just, like, kind of giving you an idea of... Um, yeah, I don't want, I don't want to bring any of them up. I don't, I just, I don't want anything to do with them. I don't want anything. I don't want them to, you know, they screenshot all my shit behind blocks and make fun of me. I don't care. I don't care. I didn't care until my video started suspiciously getting banned from YouTube. And then my entire channel got banned. Okay. So I didn't give a fuck about all the shit they said about me until that happened. And at the same time, Hunter Avalone is accusing me of like tricking kids in a discord server with, without any kind of substantial evidence, of course that turned out to be true or fa like fake. Like, why would that be true? Why would anybody believe that I would do that? Yeah. Uh, so I have no idea um, what what Hunter is saying, but like, but you were there. Well, uh, Hunter saying about you in Discord servers. Okay. What was he saying about you in Discord servers? Uh, let's just stick to. Um, what you said, which was that um, she's on some conspiracy theory bullshit. Uh, at least, luckily for us, nobody will ever take her seriously again. And, um, you know, that's one thing that we can, uh, we can take as like a silver lining, basically, that she's so insane and her conspiracy theories are so stupid that if she ever says something, everybody will discount what she says. I'm paraphrasing, but that's more or less what you said. Okay. And then you said that you've been interacting with me for the last few months as if you had some kind of basis for this. And I don't think that we've talked since like like the beginning yeah, of this year. We haven't really been talking. Um I don't know uh I guess I would I guess like if I so so the more extreme stuff stuff like it sounds possible I could have said that stuff and if I did like um like, I don't know what the fuck I would be talking about if I was claiming that I, like, I was talking to you. Because I, I hadn't been talking to you for a few months. We kind of both kind of, like, got caught up in our own stuff. So, um, as far as, like, the conspiracy theory stuff, like, um, uh, I think, I think Chud Logic in that stream actually clarified for me that, like, uh, I just knew that you were making some videos on, like, some stuff that seemed, like, conspiracy-ish or conspiracy-adjacent. Um, and Chud Logic said that, oh, it's really not, like, that far off the deep end. I think it was more like Nick who was saying, like, that it was super far off the deep end. So. 
Do you think that any of those people have watched my video series, Stardust? Well, I think Chud Logic did, didn't he? He watched the first episode. Oh, okay. Um, have yeah, you watched it? I have not watched it. No, and I said that. I'm just much. trying to understand why you would say those things that ended up getting spread all over the internet and destroying not only my work and my reputation, but the work of the team of investigators that spent months working on a series that was investigation that was definitely not anything to do with conspiracy theories. That was a lie that somebody told that they tricked you into spreading and saying something really mean about it. I'm just wondering why you would get up there and just lie and just like pat those guys on the back. Like what's going on there? That's not like what I remember from you. That's not what, that's not something that I would think that you would do like from, you know, our previous interactions. Um, and I don't know if you were just pressured to kind of say something or, or what, but like, this is like way out of control. Uh, at yeah. this point. Okay, um, so I don't think I've mentioned you beyond that Chud Logic stream. And I'm sorry if the stuff that I said in that Chud Logic stream was uh, hurtful, but it just looked like the videos that I was looking at that were on your channel uh, seemed kind of out there. And they were all, they all seemed kind of very, um, very like um, obsessive over like specific, like uh, I think it was like specific events. Um, and so it just, it kind of seemed like a little bit off the deep end to me, but Ted Logic said he watched it and he clarified for me. He said, well, it's not really that off that deep end. But so. like what, I'm just curious, like, you know, do you normally just go to somebody's page and look at their thumbnails and go, this person is mentally insane or is that, is that what I said? I mean, <laughs> here's what you said. Let, let's just, let's, I, I've got it right here. Hold on. Okay. This was like, stop shitting on me on Twitter because every time you call me crazy, it's like we're one percent away from me helping save the civilization. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So if I can say, like, yeah, I, you know, I was I was telling Nick this last night. I think that if um, one thing that you can come out that we can come away with from this is that at least it when people look at these conspiracy theories now that she's kind of peddling, we people can look at her and be like, oh, this is the type of person that believes in this. I really shouldn't believe in this. This must be dumb as fuck, you know? Um, and yeah, so, was so well. at least there's that. And also, I mean, if she's the one thing that's like standing between us and like a civil war, I think we deserve it. Honestly, I really yeah. do. You know, but I do hope she gets her, her YouTube channel back. But All right, Stardust, have you watched the videos about this? Uh, I've only seen, no, I haven't watched the videos. So oh, there we go again. Oh, yeah. I'm sure you know a little about it then, don't you? <laughs> no, I mean, I, 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 fair enough. I, I've been interacting with her for the past few months, though, so. It's well, time to go and rumble, huh. okay? Okay, well, I don't, I, yeah, I guess I, I, don't, I didn't remember that. But, uh, um, yeah, I mean. Do you know how far that rumor went? Do you realize that that yeah. rumor destroyed my channel, destroyed my reputation? Uh, uh, Do you know so that I have people in here right now clipping everything and trying to get me banned from Twitch? What the fuck is going on? Okay, so I don't agree with deplatforming, obviously, but um, but I think like I don't know I, with the whole content creator stuff. Like, look, you played it for me. I said it. Um, so clear, I I didn't remember it, but clearly I said that shit, and that was <laughs> that was pretty fucking brutal. Um, but um, but yeah, when I, I think it was a lie. Uh, well, when so, I looked at I mean, your channel, when I looked at your channel, and and again, what people were saying to me is like she's talking about like a civil war and stuff, and she's super obsessed with specific events. You know, and Stardust. Maybe when somebody, these people, right, who have lied in the past, who have spread fake racist hate videos about me after I defended you, you remember, right? Maybe if these same toxic, disgusting, sexist people are telling you something. Maybe they're not good people, and maybe they're lying to you, and maybe that should teach Nick you a lesson about who you trust. Okay, but but was Nicholas one of those people who spent? Yes, he was. The toxic racist. No, Nicholas thing? is the one who's been uh, blocking me. Well, he's had me blocked for a year, and he's been screenshotting everything, and uh, you know, just posting shit that I say on my own feed on his feed behind a block for people to tease me and make fun of me and make gross jokes about my body and what a whore I am, you know, stuff like that. You know. Stuff that they do. You know what they do. Don't act like you don't. 
Yeah, well, okay, look, I uh, I don't really have much to say. I just kind of view it like Todd Logic talks trash on me, right? Like, I'm sure when Nick, when when anybody in the- Does he ever say that Stardust is so crazy that nobody should ever believe anything that she says? In fact, I think that if, she's, if, if she says something, you should just automatically assume that thing is false because that's how stupid she is. Does he ever say anything like that? Right. Uh, I'm pretty sure that anybody in commentary that I'm friendly with would would not uh, hesitate to call me dumb as fuck if I did something really dumb as fuck. Yeah, you could you could say dumb as fuck, but like if you do something dumb as fuck, but would you ever just say, you know, oh, nobody should ever ever listen to that person again. They're probably not even like you know, she's probably not even really a blank. Whatever you do for a living, right? Just discredit you to the point that. Nobody should ever take you seriously, well, right? I that's not with, that's not joking. Just, that's called a smear. Yeah. Do you understand so what a smear I, is? That's yeah, called I defaming. I, I, whenever people say that about you, when they say like, oh, I bet she's not even a firearm instructor or whatever, I disagree with people very publicly about that because I, I, don't, I don't agree with that. But yeah, when it comes to stuff about like, be, like making video after video on like what seems like just like school shootings and stuff, it seems like it seems kind of I don't wacky. know what that means because I have videos on all kinds of things. I was putting out an investigative series about uh, basically a true crime documentary. Okay. Do you know what acceleration is? Accelerationism is? Yeah. Well, then why would you act so surprised when I'm talking about acceleration to a civil war being a motive behind mass shootings because that's what that's what acceleration is. Okay. So this sounds like it's normal to you, but to me sitting here hearing accelerationism, accelerationism is an ideology that super French political people believe in. And they hope that basically their, their view is that they hope things accelerate to such a bad state that, uh, that, um, things change, that things have to change dramatically. And these are super fringe fucking people. Right. So when you're talking about, um, accelerationism through Matt, yeah, they're fringe people. They're mass- dangerous. Okay. When you're talking about accelerationism through mass shootings, uh, that's leading to a civil war in America, it sounds wacky to me, man. That's not a conspiracy theory, though. I mean, would you like to see the Senate, the, the congressional um, experts panel that just came out like a few months ago on that exact topic? Or Sure. Send it to me. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I would just say that, um, you know, even if you saw, thought something was kind of wacky, if you don't really have any basis for calling it a deranged, insane conspiracy theory and discrediting the work, four months of work that had nothing to do with the conspiracy at all. And it really was just a mental health. It was, and if anything, it was a mental health awareness, radicalization awareness. <laughs> well, you could have been farther from a conspiracy. So, I mean, honestly, okay. I just think so that you should you- just apologize and okay. correct the record. Okay, so I don't know enough about your videos to say then what why the are. fuck would you say something about it? It was that defamatory. I <laughs> uh, look. I didn't realize that my words would travel so far. Um, and I and you know I don't. They know only my- had to travel to me to let me know what you did was really fucked up. I didn't care if I was the only person in the world that heard it. It would still be wrong and fucked up to me. It would be the same amount of fucked up if it was just said to me. As if it was said to the entire world. Because okay. I feel like I have defended you in the past. We had no bad blood. And all no, of a sudden, right. you're teaming up with the people attacking me and no, dogpiling me. What the I'm fuck? I'm not teaming up with them. I'm not teaming up with them. Okay. So you're not. Okay. What, 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 their, their content is different from mine. I am still doing my own stuff. And I will have you know that generally, even though I'm friends with commentary creators, their audience fucking hate me. They hate my guts. So uh, it's not like I am teaming up with them on anything. Right. Um, but, um, yeah, I, I'm going to say like, when, uh, again, you say this about, um, uh, about this accelerationism towards a civil war, I don't think you understand to anybody else who, who is listening to that. It sounds an, like an very, uninformed person, very, very, very strange, very out there. Well, maybe that's a problem. Do you think that maybe if that if this is a cause of an increase in mass shootings, that that's concerning that people aren't aware of that, or that maybe I mean, people should be informed so that they can look for the signs in their family members, you know, their kids, make sure that, do, that they're not think that's visiting scary for forums and radicalizing. 
Do, do you think that's a reason for all school shootings or most school shootings? I don't know why you keep saying school shootings. I don't, I, this or isn't mass, about sorry. a school shooting. No, you don't even know the first mass, thing about it. Mass shooting. Sorry. You think that's a, that you think that that is the, the main reason behind most uh, mass shootings? No, I don't. Okay. I'm not, I'm not here to explain like an entire docu-series that I spent this much time on to you. You know, I think that the point is that when you say stuff like that, that was mean and uh, really harmful, um, you said it about, you know, furthermore, like, you know, you say it about a series that has nothing to do with, I mean, it doesn't even really have anything to do with accelerationism. It was just like a true crime series, but you hadn't even watched it, right? But, but you, so you just let these guys lie to you. And you, you just brought up accelerationism just now. You, you were the one who brought, I wasn't even the one who brought Because you were talking about a DM that I sent to Bo Blacks asking him to cover the series. Because he leaked it. Because they're all pieces of shit, Stardust. They'll do the same thing to you. Um, okay. You got um, warned right now, like, that they will. So sure. that's all okay. I'm going to say. That's all, all I have right. to say. So I, um, I have not been keeping up with whatever drama you have with the commentary people because again I have my own. Wait, you, you know, just insert yourself on. into it, right? Whenever Chud Logic is live, you just hop on and insert yourself when into it, whatever well, drama okay. you're in. I I don't. Even if it's somebody who was formerly your friend who defended you, who you had no bad blood with, you didn't reach yeah, out to me to ask actually, me for clarification. Okay, so wait a minute, wait a minute. If we're gonna if we're gonna go here, right? I, um, I was very grateful for you, for, to you for that. And when all that stuff was happening with them sh sharing that video around, I made sure to reach out to multiple people within the commentary community to make sure that like they could actually help you with the stuff with the, that stalker guy and your daughter. So it's not like I didn't do, uh, like absolutely nothing. I was actually, I was defending you to these people in private, but, um, but yeah, sometimes, um, we're content creators. And we comment on the stuff that uh, of of each other. Chub Logic just ripped me a new asshole the other day. It's not mm -hmm. it's not a huge deal. Nick ripped. Did he get your channel ban? Too. Did he get your channel ban? I don't think you. I don't think any of them. They're they're all anti deep. Did they? Okay, well, hold on. Did they tell? Did they go online to all of their uh, their followers and say that you're a danger to yourself and others, and that maybe you have something illegal on your computer, and the police should come to your house and check on your child? Um. They uh, they said that that you had something illegal on your computer. They did. He said I. Yes, he did. No, okay, Dario so said that. Yeah. What 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 um what uh you know other people have said about me is that oh Stardust is irresponsible. She's spreading really irresponsible messages. Um, uh -huh. I can't believe that she would be this insensitive. Blah blah blah. And these are the same people who say way edgier things than I do. So like it's not. They said that I was the... mentally insane and needed to be put in a hospital and have CPS come and take away my fucking kid. I'm sorry that they're saying that you're spreading. Uh, you know, uh, you know, <laughs> like the, what you're saying is like so beyond me. Like you don't have any clue. You know, what these people have put me through for the last. I have people sitting in my channel right now, clipping everything out of context doing everything they can to destroy me. Um, I have people who are telling me I'm a disgusting piece of shit because I am glorifying mass shootings, which is something that I never did. It's insulting to my hard work. I put work into my content. I investigate things. I just brought down a fucking international pedophile. Okay? Like, well, I have sense. shit to do. That's basic. I do actual content, my own content that I work hard on. You know, I'm not just reacting to other people's shit. And whenever somebody goes out of their way to spread a rumor and people just parrot that rumor without knowing anything about it, without knowing if it's true, and then that rumor destroys my entire online reputation. So that now that if you look me up, all you find are videos about how insane, deranged, unhinged, what a liar I am. Right? That's called a smear job, Stardust. You know what that I don't is? Think I don't think you're a liar. I just thought that your videos looked unhinged. Well, thanks for watching them before you decided it based off a thumbnail. Like, I can look at any fucking YouTuber's page and just look at their thumbnails and go, holy fuck, this person's unhinged. Like, what? Really? Yeah. Based yeah, on the somebody's, thumbnails. Okay, if somebody, you didn't watch it. If somebody's <laughs> obsessively making videos, like if the quartering is, is making videos on Brie Larson over and over again, I'm going to think he's deranged about Brie Larson. Do you know, did if you, did making, you not, did you not wait, like you're making, comprehend you're making, that it's a money, series? If you're, making, if you're making video after video on mass shooting, I'm going to think that you're a little deranged about mass shootings. Like, 
That's just what it is. That's just how do you it think is. about reaching out to me to talk about it? Or do you just put me on blast? I mean, like look, being I ignorant? On, like I jumped onto Chud Logic stream, but like, I don't remember half the shit that I say yesterday, dude. Well, maybe that's a problem that you should reflect on. Okay. All right. Bye. That was weird. Stardust Cam is a banana. Clearly she is unhinged. Hey, this is an easy game to play. <laughs> That's so funny. Fuck. I love that. That is hilarious.